They say, what dua do we make? Ah, I'm getting WhatsApp messages. These five pages of dua. MashaAllah, okay. And then they're making YouTube clips about dua and dua and dua and dua. Dua for what? For me, so I can get some big things. Uh, in your heart, has, you have to have nothing. Nothing except Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You have to get your the freed mimma siwallah. You have to empty your heart. You have to make it one for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from everything. That's why Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has said, and this is a hadith, a sahih hadith, mentioned by Imam al-Tirmizi. He said that, khayru um, dua dua yawm arafah The best dua that you can make is the dua on arafah. So don't forget, make dua. Wa khayru ma qultu ana wa nabiyyun. And the best that I have said, me and the prophets before me. What did he say? What did he say? What do you think? Did, did, did he ask for the gold of this world? Did he ask for the Jannah in the hereafter? Did he ask for this and that, for this and that? What did he say? خَيْرُ مَا قُلْتُ أَنَا وَالنَّبِيُّونَ لَا إِلَهَ إِلَّا اللَّهُ وَحْدَهُ وَحْدَهُ Only Allah. لا شريك له. There is no partners for him in my heart. Only him. له الملك. To him belongs dunya and akhirah. And to him belongs all the praises. He gives life, he takes life as he wishes. He gives life to whomever he wants. And he takes life from whoever he wants. And he is certainly capable of everything. That is what Rasulullah said. The best that I have said. Look, he is not asking for anything like us. We want this and we want that. We want to fly in air and we want to walk on water. We want to see angels and we want to impress others that we talk to spiritual beings. We want this and we want that. Rasulullah has done all of that and he doesn't care. He said, Khayru ma qul. The best that I asked for, the best that I said is La ilaha illallah, wahdahu la sharika la. So be busy with that dua. If you want to make the other dua, of course, it's permissible. But get yourself unattached to dunya. Get your heart unattached to wants. Ask for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Let him be enough for you. If he is enough for you, you have entered the ocean of Quran. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Alaysa Allahu bikafin abda. Am I not enough for you, O oh my servant? Is he? Ask yourselves. Is Allah enough for you? Does he say the truth? Do you say, Ya Rabbi, sadaqta? Ya Rabbi, you said the truth. Yes, you are enough for me. Do you say that in your heart? You don't. I don't, we don't, they don't. We have, our Iman has become so low. All what we do is ask more pleasure, how I can get pleasure more and more. Here I want pleasure, and also in Akhirah I want pleasure. 